what you hear outside. Do you hear that? That is freezing rain. We have freezing rain all throughout Western New York today. I hope you're inside safe. And I want to talk to you today about orange cones. No, about construction projects. Construction projects seem to be the bane of our existence. Today I was taking our kids to school. It's my daughter's 11th birthday. And lo and behold, our normal route to school is cut off because there's construction in the middle of the road. I have to veer it around, go this way and that way, and finally find my way to taking them to school. And that's how often it's like. Well, today I'm gonna tell you a little lesson about why construction projects are so important and a big salute to all of you out there that actually work on them. I know it's not hard, not that easy, especially in this kind of condition. Uh, so this week we learn about the tabernacle, the uh, sanctuary, the traveling sanctuary. And this is the big construction project of the Israelite people. It's so big, the next five weeks, five Torah portions, we're going to be learning about it. It starts this week with Truma, with the donations, and will continue step by step as they make all the implements of this large traveling sanctuary. And it seems kind of ridiculous. They're walking here through the wilderness. They are completely defenseless. An army can attack at any time, and yet they're building this structure that has uh, no, that, that will not prevent uh, this, uh, you know, that's indefensible. Uh, and they're spending all their time on it. Why? And why is it so important? Uh, why are these orange cones so vital? When I came to Buffalo, it was in a depressed state 10 years ago. Uh, nothing was happening. There were no projects at all. You go up the, the road to Canada, to Toronto, and you just see crane after crane after crane. Uh, in Israel, that's the joke. What's the national bird of Israel? Not the hoopy, the actual bird, the crane, because there's so many cranes. Uh, and now, uh, 10 years later, there are construction projects all over, because that's what we need. It shows vitality. There's something about these orange cones, there's something about building something that makes human beings the best human beings that they can be. So next time you see one of these, or you have to go around a detour, or you see something going up, and maybe it's going to take years, know that without it, we have nothing. We need to keep building, keep building sanctuaries and tabernacles that don't necessarily have a specific purpose at making our you know, making, uh, protecting us from outsiders. But what they do is they make everything feel so much better. So have a great day, stay safe, and please don't slip. <laughs> Take care. Shabbat Shalom.